there's an earlier flight getting out. I want to be on the, on that flight. So once Roe v. Wade is overturned, we'll be like Louisiana, we'll be like North and South Dakota, and we'll be like Mississippi. Kentucky's values are to, to defend life. State Representative Joe Fisher is the sponsor of House Bill 148. The bill would ban any type of abortion unless a doctor deems the mother's life to be at risk. It would go into effect immediately in the event the U.S. Supreme Court ever decided to overturn Roe versus Wade. I'm just really disappointed that we're here today talking about something that might not happen for several, several years, that there are still a lot of unanswered questions. According to the language in the bill, a doctor who performs an illegal abortion could be charged with a felony and face one to five years in jail. A group that opposes the bill spoke during the hearing. From our perspective, it tries to take something that can be incredibly incredibly complicated, the lived experiences of pregnant people, and make it very simple. The truth is that outlawing abortion would put pregnant people's lives and health at risk. Representative Stan Lee, who voted in favor of the bill, quoted the Declaration of Independence to support his stance. It says that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights. And Mr. Chairman, ladies and gentlemen, members of the committee, do you know what the first right listed is? It's the right to life. And many of those who were here to oppose House Bill 148 say they will return to Frankfurt Thursday to speak out against Senate Bill 9, which would ban abortion once a fetal heartbeat is detected. In Frankfurt, Carrie Grace, WLKY News.